on. You get ready to get it back. Press down, shake it down. And what are you is there? Anybody here that believe God? Give God a praise right now. So yes, okay. So now we look, favor means something that you did not deserve to handle what you need. Next thing that you gotta understand, this only for 10 people to give God praise, and this is for you right now. Favor is being released over your life right now. Hallelujah! 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 This is what I just said. Yes, Lord. Favor, if you're in this room right now, favor is being released over your life. Right now. I still don't think they get it. I still don't, I still, I still don't think they don't get it. What I'm saying is that before this week came into fruition, there was some stuff that's been saying no in your life. Okay, there's some stuff that you have been believing God for, but having some issues acquiescing to it, or grabbing it, or pulling it into your spirit. But the Lord told me to declare over this house that whatever said no this week prior, God said get ready because every no is getting ready to be a yes. Oh, y'all pray with me. Y'all pray with me. God said, get ready to walk into a season that everything tells you yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Yes, God. We don't your neighbor say everything, everything, everything. We got somebody tell them everything, everything. It's here ready to be a yes. Anybody believe God is here ready to be a yes? God said, go back to the landlord. They're going to put your rent down. Y'all ain't still here. Go back to your job that said no. It's here ready to say yes. Somebody told you that you are overqualified. In this season, it's going to say you're qualified. God, God said that faith will be released. And you got to know how to grab it right now. I need to scream. I grab my faith. Scream for it right now, like yeah. you need that. I said, scream like you need favor. Watch this, watch this, watch this, watch this. So we look at uh, Psalms five and twelve. It said, "For the Lord will bless the righteousness with favor, and it will thou compass him as his shield." And I'll tell you something, in order to receive favor, you got to be a favor. That's right, man. That's right. That's right. This is what we're going to do. This is what I'm going to challenge you this week. This is what we're going to do. Every day this week, uh-huh. yes. I want you to do a favor for somebody yes. and don't ask for nothing. Yes, yes, yes. I want you to do a favor yes. for somebody. Y'all hear me? Yes. You understand what I'm saying? Yes. Yes. Every day. Somebody shout every day. Every day. I want you to do a favor for somebody mm -hmm. that you know, come on here, that took, mm, I don't ask no for nothing, because some of you, because some of you didn't file a payback next week, no, 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 I'm, no, I'm, I'm, cause, cause what happens is, you're trying to come up with your own favor account. Yes, yes, sir, yes, sir. Girl, she owe me five, she owe me 10, and she owe me five. So I got $20 out there right now. So you got an account of how much your faith is going to be. God said, take the limit off of me. Yes. Just bless somebody and trust God. Yes. Oh, y'all ain't hearing me. And when you trust God, God said, I'm giving you an unlimited account. Yes. When you have an unlimited account, it means you can have what you want. Yes. All you got to do is just swipe the card and it's there. Me yes. owe me 10. Cliff owe me 5. First lady, she owed me six, so I got $21 out there. I could go somewhere, but if, if they would just give me my money. Uh -huh. 
Oh, y'all hear y'all in the spirit. If they, if they just give me my money, I'll be straight. <laughs> so they say, you don't, you don't need nobody else's money. <laughs> All you need is favor. If, if, if they look out, then I'll be good. No, stop waiting on somebody to bless you. That's right. And start walking in favor. Yeah. Yeah. Right, the Lord said favor is coming for you. Yes. So what are we doing? Every day this week, right? Yes. Every day this week. Every day the rest of the month. I want you to be a favor to somebody. Yes. And I'm not talking about stuff. I'm not talking about something that don't. I mean, I'm talking about something that. A, a real, a real favor for somebody. I'm not talking about giving them a dollar so they can get some corn chips or something. At the, at the, at the, I'm talking about something that comes out of your being, yes. something that you thought about to be a blessing. Deliberately bless somebody, and God will deliberately bless you. Yes. Deliberately favor somebody, and God will deliberately favor you. But we got so many people that's too stingy to receive favor. Y'all ain't hearing me. You get $10, you holding on to all 10 of your dollars. <laughs> ain't got but 10. Hold on there. They don't know I got to do to get $10. No, give it away. Y'all know what I had to do to get $10. They don't, they don't know my son. No, give it away. I bet you it come back to you. Press down, shake it together, run it over. Can I give y'all a testimony? I told them Wednesday. We went into the we went into the place that we rent the van from. The yeah. man reached in his pocket and gave me five hundred dollars. Oh. Y'all ain't hearing what I'm saying? Yeah. I took that seat. This ain't the end of it. I took that seat. Bless my son John. On that Friday, come on, should I tell you? I got a check for two hundred and sixty dollars. Yeah. 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 Say neighbor. If they will follow on a leader, then show them that the like favor gonna fall on me. Go to check here, your pastor. Boom, that's you. Wow. Not about what twenty dollars. Look at two hundred and sixty dollars. Yes, sir. That's all I hollering. Can you tell me that's all? Ah, God, shot. Ah, 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 ah. So I took 10% of the favor that I received, gave it to my son. He then gives, then, then I get I get a check for $260. So he multiplied what I gave quickly. Y'all hear what I'm saying? If you give it in the right spirit, y'all hear what I'm saying? Don't give it in the wrong spirit, give it in the right spirit. And watch God multiply what you gave and give it to somebody else. Y'all hear what I'm saying? So that means at 10% of every favor that you get, you give 10% to your church and 10% to somebody else. You understand what I'm saying? So 80% of your miracle is yours. The other 20 is for somebody else. The problem is you take your whole miracle and spend it on you. Yeah, I'm getting my head done. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm going out of town. We're going to Murray Beach and spend all your money. Come back with $3. $3. But you don't sow properly. So if you don't sow properly, you're not going to reap properly. You're trying to figure out where your money going. Your money went to your hair. Your money went to, come on here, on rims. Y'all ain't sitting up here. How you, how you got rims that still live in an apartment? The devil is alive. So you ain't saying, get your house first. And live in apartment 22B. Yeah. That's right. That's right. I'm talking to this, it don't make sense. It don't make sense. Look at your name and say, live, live. According, according to what you have. What you have. Yes. Stop trying to be bigger than what you are. Yes. Stop trying to act like you all that. It's all right, honey. Yes. You keep your little Toyota Corolla clean. Yes. You ain't got to try to put rims on and look good. Yes. We got rims on a Toyota Corolla for eight hours. Right. <laughs> Somebody shout hallelujah. hallelujah. Favor this season is coming to people that know how to take care of seed that's given to them. Yes, right. Yes. Huh? Yes. 